G'day guys, it's Billy here from losttreasure.com.au Well, I'm just going for a walk around this lake, first time I've been here before the reason I've been here after this job being past I've seen, you know, the odd sparkle of glass So I thought I'd come for a walk and already found a couple of interesting things Just down here I found myself a nice little um, Schweppes bottle It'll be from the 1970s, 60s, 70s And just down here is some nice old insulators um, just while I'm filming this about the insulators, if you guys in Australia or maybe overseas, I'm not too sure. But even just these insulator sticks are worth money. Not just the insulators, just the sticks themselves. I've seen these sell on eBay for quite a, um, quite some, you know, good bits of money just for the sticks only. So yeah, I might grab some now and um, yeah, take them with me. <coughs> So these are the glass insulators guys and how I just mentioned before I've actually seen these for sale on eBay before so just a tip for you is if you're in Australia same goes for an America probably I'm not too sure if they have these in America but these actually unscrew and I've actually seen these sell for pretty good money on eBay so if you do come across the old telephone insulators these things here people definitely buy these on eBay so if you ever come across the old telephone lines on the side of the gravel roads and old bush tracks and that and if you come across these you can not only sell these, you can sell the glass insulators but if they're in really good condition, this is in pretty good condition, you can always clean them up a bit of sandpaper and so forth and yeah, they'll sell so just a tip for you guys, if you know where they are, collect them up and make a bit of money for yourself on eBay alright guys, let's chat to Alright guys, I'll chat soon. Thanks for watching. See ya.